Some of you, you have everything you want in your life, but you know what the problem is? You're going to get comfortable. You're going to get complacent. You're going to have mediocrity, and somebody's going to come, and they're going to want what you have, and when you let your foot off the gas, they're going to put their foot on the gas, and they're going to kick your freaking ass. Listen to me. Over my dead body is somebody going to take what I've worked hard for. I made straight D's in school. I stuttered. I didn't know what I was doing. I didn't believe in myself. My dad said, get a job and stay out of jail. And everybody told me I was gonna be a loser. I was raised poor. I was the kid that literally growing up, like I had friends and they had money. They were cool kids. But like when their parents came home, it was like, oh, let's all go out to eat. Like they dropped the poor kid off and then all the other friends went to go eat because you could tell that I was poor. Like, dude, I knew, what it, I knew the way people looked at me, but I knew there was gonna be a point in time in one day in my life in which I was gonna get an opportunity. You can totally recreate your life and be with a group of people right now that actually care about you changing and becoming a winner and make money, which is priceless. You guys can do all this. All I asked God for, at 18, I said, man, would you just give me a way out? Just, like, I don't, wanna, I don't want this life no more. I don't like this. I don't, I don't like me. Be where your feet are. What does that mean? That means we're fucking here right now. Okay? So don't be thinking about 30 minutes from now. Don't be thinking about tonight. Don't be thinking about your plane flight. Dude, the reason why a lot of you get smoked it's because you're never really where you are. You want a better marriage, but when you're at home, you're thinking about work. When you're at work, you're thinking about being at home. When you're at the gym, you're fucking somewhere else. That's why you never change. I looked in the mirror, I was out of shape, and I didn't like me. I could tell that my team wasn't choosing me as their leader. I had to make a decision. Is this the best me or has the best me not been seen yet? Guys, I wanna ask you this. Do you have more? If you do, then let's get it now. Now listen to me. People are not gonna to wanna to see you change. People are not gonna believe in you. You're gonna to have to believe in you. This is not a motivational speech. This is a new play to run. Everybody, listen to me. I, I, I see people all the time and they're like, hey man, I wanna kill it. You know what I say? I say, well, it's time to run a new play. Whatever you're getting in life right now is because of the play that you're running right now. So if you wanna get different results, if you wanna get a different income, if you wanna get a different body, if you wanna get a different lifestyle, if you wanna make better relationships, if you wanna do all that, gotta run a new play.